Singapore, a thriving multicultural world city. An Asian tiger playing a key role on the world stage. But just below the surface of this former British colony lies a history of foreign invasion, smouldering racial tension and violent struggle against imperial power. After more than 100 years of colonial rule, in 1941 the flames of independence were lit when Japan bombed Singapore. It was the next morning when I went up to my room and this, that's what I discovered. The shrapnel right in the middle of my pillow where my head would have been. The Japanese Imperial Army invaded Malaya and Singapore, triggering an explosion of social conflict amongst the Chinese, Malay and Indian communities. The coming of the Japanese present a recipe for racial disaster. For the Japanese, it was part of a campaign to expand their empire and expel the white colonials from Asia. The Japanese despised the Anglo-Saxon powers that had occupied most of Asia. The propaganda at the time is all about ridding Asia of the white man. It was a call to arms that echoed within the ranks of the British Army, causing 20,000 British Indian Army soldiers to switch sides and fight for the Japanese. It's a sign of things to come. When those men at the end of the war go back to India, they're hailed as national heroes because they fought against an imperial power. Singapore, the bastion of the British Empire, fell in just 70 days, shattering Australia's faith in Britain, forcing it to turn to America. The shock to Australians, the dominion is threatened and the mother country can do almost nothing. The fall of Singapore heralded the beginning of the end of the British Empire. It changed Southeast Asia forever and compelled Australia to face the reality of becoming an Asian nation.